Hello everyone and welcome back to 5 minutes a day. Hopefully you were able to complete yesterday's challenge of spending 10 minutes in silence and solitude and just giving God time to speak to you and waiting on him and hopefully you were able to meet with him in those moments. And today's topic that we're going to be talking about is worship and how worship can help us grow in our relationship with God. And we're going to focus on two main areas. Firstly, how to worship and secondly, how we can use our talents and our gifts in worship and to worship God. So first we're going to kind of talk about how to worship and where to worship. Uh, a lot of people think that worship just takes place on a Sunday in church when everyone comes together and yes, worship is a part of that but worship is so much more as well and we can take part in worship daily and we should be taking part in worship daily whether you play an instrument or sing or don't think you are very musically talented at all it's still so good to worship god and just put some worship music on and find a place where you feel free to just worship him and also stepping out of your comfort zone when you are worshiping him and just using your bodies to just praise him and give him the praise that he deserves and sometimes it is a bit kind of like you're looking around in a bigger setting like church and oh I don't know if I should raise my hand but it isn't about that it's about you and God in that moment and just worshipping how you feel comfortable whether it is raising your hands whether it's just closing your eyes or standing there still it's just yeah worshipping in your own way and giving him the praise that he deserves and sometimes stepping out of your comfort zone to just give praise to God. Secondly we're going to talk about how we can use our gifts and talents to worship God and we're all so uniquely and wonderfully made that we all have so many different talents and we should be using those to bring glory to God and give him praise through using our talents. Now, if you're thinking, oh, how could I use my talents or I don't have any talents to worship God with, that's not true. Everyone has so many different talents and they're all so unique and different from one another. And I kind of wanted to talk about Ephesians 2 verse 10 quickly and just read that to you. And it says, for we are God's masterpiece. He has created us anew in Christ Jesus, so we can do the good things he has planned for us long ago. We were created to do what God planned for us, and he's given us our unique talents to be able to worship him in those plans. And I think that's so incredible, and we should definitely be investing time into our talents to worship us, whether it's music, drama, mechanics, uh, whether it's cooking or sports, there's so many talents that we can use to worship God. And it's just pressing into those talents and seeing how God wants us to use them and praying when we are doing those things. Whether it's before we go and do a drama performance, praying to God, or before we're about to do a big game, uh, whether it's netball or football, something like that just praying in those moments that God is with us and we can use them to bring glory to his name. So today's challenge is I want you to spend some time investing into one of your talents or a couple of your talents. For example, if you think one of your talents is cooking, baking, spending some time with God whilst you're baking something and just yeah, invest time into your talents and also just spend some time thanking God for making you so uniquely and giving you such special talents and that you would be able to use those to bring glory to his name and worship him so yeah guys i hope you have a great day and i will see you tomorrow